Today is the last day of preparations for our Christmas auction. Um, let me think. I think I need a bit of help. Just give me one second. Oh, Tink! Yeah? Do we'd like to come in and talk about whiskey to the lovely people? Things I do. I cannot believe. You yeah, look! Godless. You wouldn't even let me shave my legs. I mean, if I had been able to shave my legs, it might have been something, you know, but... No, but you're all natural. You see, the elves don't shave their legs. Well, we might need a bit of warm top and do it in our pod. There you go. So, today is the last day. My bell rings when I nod my head. I can't believe you made me wear a naughty, naughty head as well. You can take it off now. Can I? Because yeah, it, it actually it's it's, it's probably, you, yeah. The hat I quite like, actually. I might go out in the hat. Actually. I, I think you should go out in the whole fucking thing. I probably might just go out in the whole thing. You actually get enough whiskey, man, and do it. I don't need whiskey, man, to do it, and actually have to trip it Yeah, remember, no, just, I just want to make a point to take before we start doing this, right? Okay. So, when you're moving around. Yes. No, 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 Tink, don't bend what over. Is, no, it's, tink, a, it's okay, I don't have the camera on him. It's okay, Tink, don't bend over. Okay. Okay, now carry on. Okay, so what are you saying that, that I'm not allowed to just, what, if I accidentally, nope. so, no, or, or something, no? Keep up. Okay. Remember I showed you how to bend like a knee. Are you sure you're not no, allowed to? No, that's bending like a hoe. Alright, okay. So, what do you think? Right, do, we do look cute, don't we? We look fabulous. I do, we do look. look. Happy Christmas! Hi! <laughs> well done. Right, so, <laughs> if I have to get something in the bottom... No, no, I'll, no, I'll get shot. it, I'll get it. That's it, I... No, you do realise that your daughter is filming this. And, so, so she's 22, so obviously she's never seen one before. Or an hour's. She shouldn't be seeing her father's ass, but... Fair point. Yeah, yeah that's on. the council part. Um, Go for me, so bitch. So, <laughs> today... <laughs> yes. <laughs> Anyhow... Today we go live, five o'clock today. <laughs> and then it's Holly Bobs. Going through the entire auction site and making sure everything's alright. Holly Bobs. <laughs> no, okay. Um <laughs> we have I think everything's nearly uploaded. Um I was just finalizing it this morning. The the top page is is what we've left to do. So what I hold back to do the top page, we have um the um, we have a 25-year-old, a 26-year-old, and a 30-year-old Middleton. Yeah. They are ultra collectible. They are the ones that I think people should be collecting. They're the ones that, in years to come, you know... Oh, again, you've always said that, I've because, all, because they're limited numbers. They are limited numbers, and they're gorgeous presentations. They're legacy whiskey. They're not even Middleton. They're old Middleton distillery. So, again, they're the bottles that people want to be collecting. Um, we have that Abelure 1964... We have a 15-year-old Poppy Van Winkle. Uh, these are the ones that everybody loses their shit in a minute. Um, that's the family reserve. They are can only be got sometimes in ballots and lotteries and all that sort of stuff. So that is a 15-year-old Poppy Van Winkle. That should do really well. I know they are sought after. I'm just going to shimmy over this side. You come over here, baby. Do not come over here and stand and rub my leg? No. Sure. Um, we Sorry. have... Pa I think I mean thanks for the offer, but no. Okay. Uh, we have this kitty. This no, I've never is, seen one of them. Yeah, before. I didn't, and and I was sort of caught off guard when the bottle actually arrived into us. It's a pint bottle from the old Middleton Distillery, Cork Distillers, um, of their ten-year-old uh, red label. It's for Reardon and Sons oh, yeah, on yeah, Washington yeah, Street yeah, in Cork. Yeah, I was just um, there. Any Cork whiskey collectors or Middleton whiskey collectors. That'd be a must-have. That is, and it is in very, very good condition. I mean, considering how old it is, that's in. It's an old uh, Irish glass and bottling one, but uh, that's in really, really good nick. I mean, the label's still legible. It's got its proof marking on it and all that sort of stuff. Capsules in good nick, so that's another good one. To the charities, Katie. We'll start off. Um, oh yeah, Milroy's uh, Milroy Bay. So uh, the Baylock Distillery up in uh, Donegal. Yes. Um, he is going to start making whiskey. Um, at the minute he's doing potching, but he's doing potching with a with a tweak, and it would be Donegal potching. Which oh, that be, one, the the slightly pinky one. The slightly pinky, the samples that he yeah, gave us. Yeah, because it is it is um, 
I think it's what's that word I'm looking for? It is a peated. Peated. Yes. Peated. And we all know I'm not a big fan of the old peated whiskey. No. no. Sorry. But he had this lovely wee sample. He's putting it in a wine cask. In a wine cask, yeah. And it's just gorgeous. Yeah, it does have really, that peaty, really but there's a lovely florally smell to it too. Uh, this would be proper country potty. Yeah, this so like would moonshine. Be, yeah, this yeah. would be from the hills of Donegal. This yeah. would be it. And he's finished it in um, oak barrels and all that sort of stuff. So they're limited editions. Barrel number two, bottle number one. That's going for charity. That's raising money for the Loxwilly or an ally. Yeah. Um, so we have three charity items this month. I want to show this. I want to open this. Up you can open this I just think this is gorgeous. Uh, we have from Kinnahins. Kinnahins is a cool one because Kinnahins isn't for sale in the Republic of Ireland. No, you, no, you can't. Um, it it's mainly only in Europe and that. So this is release number thirteen. This is a single cask that was done in a Merlot, uh, finished in a Merlot cask. Um, they are. Uh, Really, really popular Germany and all the, the, the Eastern European countries and all that sort of stuff. They love their whiskey. That's 58%. That is bottle number 187 one of 300. So they're only limited editions. That'd be a rare chance to get something that you sort of can't get here. Um, I know the guys in, in Kinahins do some real mad innovative stuff, yeah. stuff with their casks. Innovative. Innovative. <laughs> with their casks. Yeah. So he done uh, the one, it was called Cask. And he used different staves from different barrels to make oh, up. Oh, I see. Uh, yeah, like uh, they made a barrel out of Made a barrel staves. out of it and, and uh, um, let the whiskey age in that. It was, um, it was actually cool. It was cool. So that's raising funds for the Maria Goretti, which is just outside Dundalk here. Yeah, it's just outside um, Lord Chip and Cooley. Maria Goretti, unfortunately, that we need things like this, is a respite home for, for children, for, children um, for, for terminally ill and really sick children. Mm. So that's raising funds for and them. And the building out there is beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they really do, I mean, God love, I, I, I can't no, fathom stuff no. like that. I really can't. Um, so that's raising funds for them. So we want to we wanna get as much as possible for them. I will give you this, because you said you wanted to open this. Yes, this is temporary. It's a single cast release, but it's a limited edition one. And I'll just open it up there for you. As we know, Tipperary usually do. <laughs> Sorry, I got distracted. Um, blue and white is their usual colours for their bottles. But this one is just fab. Wait and see this fella. Now, the reason... Sorry. No, you're all right. Carry on. Because you're not on camera, so you're all right. For the... Pinky label is because these bottles are being sold off to raise money for Irish breast cancer research. Uh, that is bottle number nine, and the reason why Jennifer and the team down in, in um, Tipperary. Tipperary decided to give us a bottle, and this is a frightening number. And yeah. I mean, it's it's really poignant that it's number nine in the bottle. One in nine women. So how many women do I know in my life? Yeah. One in nine of them will be affected by breast cancer yeah. at some stage in their life. That is a truly, truly terrifying thought. So that is a special edition label. So she's done that for us, the pink one of them. They won't be for sale uh, on them bottles. They're only being done for, for this. Uh, to, raise, and to raise funds for the charity. Raise funds for the charity. The winner of that will get... Ta -ta -ta -ta! Can you see my legs? Can you see my legs? Can you see my legs? I see my legs. I see my legs. You uh, do have lovely legs. I do have lovely legs. You do have lovely legs. Have lovely legs. Uh, you'll get it. Not we'll... as nice as mine. I'm glad you did too. <laughs> so that'll, that'll go um, a nice little, what's them bags called? A tote bag. Tote bag. I knew there was a name. There's a, a, a totally cute tote. I <laughs> did look at that. No. A totally cute uh, beanie hat. And there's also two samples of the bottle that is being raised for. So, so guys, that's it. I know we're asking a lot again as we do every month. But as you can tell from the charities, they're all worthy, worthy charities. So, so please, guys, again. So what about Katie? Is there's not down here on the bottom of the shelf no, that no, you want no, me to get? No, no come, come over here. Right, okay. Come over here. Lovely to take her bell. Woo woo. Yes, you do. Happy Christmas. Exactly. Have a wonderful Christmas. I know it's going to be strange. It's going to be strange and different and all of that sort of stuff. But look. We're all there. I probably will be online drinking at some stage, so yes. I might just post that out. And, and there'll drink be some entertaining um, photos for you to do. That'll do. Bye. Bye.